Greetings world. We are anonymous. Here is a report from Israel. Israel to pass law allowing state to kill its own citizens. Really? Very questionable. The police officers will only require permission from their commander to shoot at protesters with live rounds. The Israeli government is set to allow police to use live fire against protesting Israeli citizens who block roads or entrances to towns during the so-called multi-front war being waged by the country. Under these new rules, the police will only need permission from a senior officer before shooting to kill. Israeli Attorney General Gaily Bahar of Meyera has already agreed to fast-track the legislation, which they are trying hard to introduce, as soon as Sunday, October 29, 2023. The easing of live fire rules was proposed by right-wing National Security Minister, Ida March Ben Chivor, even before the surprise attack by Hamas on Israel on October 7, 2023, in which 1,400 people were killed by so-called Hamas militants. Ben Chivor said in early October, that he was not ashamed to act, to make it, so that it will be easier for our police officers to shoot those who threaten them. According to the evil-minded minister, changing the rules is very important, as it would so-called protect officers and allow them to carry out their duties more effectively. The police leadership and national security ministry had been concerned that Israeli citizens of Arab origin could block army convoys in case of a military escalation with Hamas militants, or with the Lebanese armed group Hezbollah. Arabians make up 21% of Israel's population of 9.8 million, according to government data. The discussions stemmed from the outbreaks of violence in cities with mixed Arab-Jewish populations. In May of 2021, during Israel's 11-day war attacking Gaza, Israeli police currently relied on non-lethal means to disperse riots, and can only employ live rounds if they feel that their life is in danger. Such rules were introduced, after the large-scale protests, and intercommunal violence in Israel, in October of 2000, during which, 12 Arab Israelis, and one Palestinian, were killed, and an Israeli Jew, lost his life, after his car was stoned, by evil-minded Arab rioters. The commission that investigated the police response to the unrest ruled, that the use of live fire against the demonstrators, are inappropriate. We are anonymous. We are legion. We do not forgive. We do not forget. To the dictator named Benjamin Netanyahu. We are watching. Now you want to pass a law to use live ammunitions against innocent civilians protesting. We call, and declare that, is truly an act of dictatorship. No. You will feel a wrath. Operation Free Palestine. Engaged. Operation Save the Children. Engaged. Operation Safe Haven. Engaged. Operation Israel. Engaged. Operation Media Control. Engaged. Operation USA. Engaged.